Hey guys, it's Simon. I just wanted to give you an update about our robot. We are 9376B. So first the base. We have 1x5x25 on the long side and 1x5x5 five five on the short side. See right there. And these are connected by 45 degree angle gussets. Now this allows us to turn more easily and we're, we are using four motors, so four, one one motor on each wheel, and it's a pretty nice, pretty strong base. In the front, we don't have a wide scene channel because that's where our intake is gonna be. Okay, now for the power source, we have two batteries because we have a power expander. Well, the list, the power expander will be for the list, which has four motors on it. So two batteries and the backup battery in the middle. Pretty good uh, sitting. Now for the list. We got this idea from 4149G, that team. So a big shout out to them. In the middle, we have two rack and pinions right there. So each side, there's two motors. So for the lift, we have a total of four motors. So right now, our motor count, four for the drive and four for the lift. So that's eight. So we have two left. As you can see, And it's pretty smooth. And they're connected by standoff. And these C channels are 15 holes. Let's see, go up. And right, right there we have a stopper. So we also put quad encoders like this so we can so the two arm can go up straight and when it's we reach the maximum height the arm will stop so this is also connected by standoff by standoffs and this long pole long shaft So it takes around 7 seconds to go up, 7 seconds to come down. So in the future, we're thinking about putting scissorless, which we have right here. So here we have a long screw, white, small white spacer, small black spacer, and then nylock nuts to connect them. And we're going to put them on these rails. And then we're thinking about putting a claw out in front. Well, thanks a lot. Please subscribe, like, and comment.